Here we go, Oilers Jets Hockey Night in Canada. We are officially underway. Great to have all of Canada along with us on this fine Saturday night. As the Oilers enter the zone, quick shot on net. Hellebuck able to grab a hold of it, and he hangs on. Good quick start and a good shot wide. Hellebuck handles it very well. When you said old Smite Division rivals, I was going to say old North Division rivals. And a lot of talk in the dressing room. These guys have seen a ton of each other that year, especially 14 times. Quick start for Edmonton. This will be something we'll look for throughout this game. More shots to the net and a mentality of getting in looking for extra afterwards. New line combinations for the Oilers. Here's a shot from the point that is handled by Hellebuck once again. Fogel now moving up with speed. Dan Martin and Dusan Hopkins still out there for Edmonton. And now it's fed ahead by Fogel as both teams are making a change. Hey, Billy. Winnipeg finishing a three-game homestand. They were one and two. Edmonton coming off a two-game road trip. They were one and one. Both teams on the hunt for just their second victories of the season. Puck picked up by Connor McDavid. Here's Leon Dreisaitl crossing the blue line. He puts on the brakes. Dreisaitl ahead to McDavid. He finds Nurse. Shoots. Scores! Darnell Nurse going top shelf for his first of the season. A quick start here for Evans. And obviously the urgency we talked about. It. Get pucks to the net. Get bodies in front. Up against one of the best goaltenders in the league. And this is something Winnipeg has had trouble with. Keep pucks out of the back of their net as of late. And a great shot, a little traffic in front of the side. Hyman to McDavid, here's Leon Dreisaitl, back to McDavid. McDavid has a look, gets it to the point, Evan Bouchard dishes back. McDavid cuts to the middle, bobbling the puck, here's a pass to Dreisaitl, back to Bouchard, he teams around, and he scores! We noticed it right out of the get-go. This is great pressure by the Winnipeg Jets, and Appleton almost disrupts that puck on McDavid's stick, but he gets it down, makes a beautiful pass over to Dreisaitl. Everybody bites thick, and he's going to take the one-time shot, but it's Bouchard that tickles the rafters. He's ready for it. He rips this one through traffic. Hellebuck takes that puck, finds Nugent Hawkins. Breakaway, the runway's clear. Bogle's in, stopped by Hellebuck, and he denies Yanmark on the rebound. Nurse with a nice little play to Nugent Hopkins with support. He threads the needle as Fogel takes off and tries to elevate on the backhand side. Good positioning. And they just kept battling through with those bouncing puck sticks and aggressiveness and found a shot. Here's Josh Morrissey looking, shooting, scoring! Josh Morrissey with his first of the season. He cuts the deficit to one here, past the midway mark of the first. Through the traffic, get that puck through. You talk about it so much, if you don't get it through, it's not going anywhere. He just waits just that little extra second as he comes into the lane, maybe just a little too far where he's not in the shooting lane anymore. And he uses him as a screen blast at far side. Tipped into the Oilers zone by Nemesnikov, under four minutes to go in the first frame. Whacking at it with CeCe, unable to get it all the way out. Perfetti behind the Oilers' net. Gets it all the way to the point. DeMello to Dylan. Slap pass to Nemesnikov. Off his stick, over to Nurse. And now the Oilers. Coming into the offensive zone. Holloway delivers it behind the Jets' net. He's off to the bench for a change. And a uh, three-on-two, a three-on-three opportunity here as the Jets... Looked like they might have had numbers, but here's Zach Hyman's second breakaway in the period for the Oilers. Hyman shooting and denied by Connor Hellebuck. To this one, as Zach Hyman, flight path was clear, rejected by Hellebuck. So don't do that. So over the years, I think we've gotten a little smarter scheduling the games a little earlier. So to play in October is a lot better. Again, looking forward to next week. You know, the Battle of Alberta and, and a good way to start our season with an outdoor game. Perfect. Steve, thanks for your time. Good to see you again. Likewise. Harner run. All right, Scott, as the second period here is underway between the Oilers and Jets, the one goal game. Lou, you and I were chatting about it. We were both at the uh, original Heritage Classic. You, you dressed your Jake up in several layers, I hear. I think six. <laughs> we can attest it was cold. My sister Gudeep and I had uh, blankets in the audience. The glasses were all fogged up. It was 
bitterly cold. Here's a chance now for the Oilers looking to add to their lead as Fogel, Janmark, bounced right over the stick of Sandberg to Kane. Ehlers, pass intercepted, Kane, stick handling, protecting that puck, McLeod, back to Kane, he moves in with Connor Brown, Brown heads off to the bench, Kane, wraparound, backhand attempt, stopped, Hellebuck was in the place that he wanted to be, here comes Matthias Ekholm, sending the puck to Derek Ryan, he's knocked off the puck, Barron, and now a chance for Kupari, he reversed it. Kane got in between. The Oilers still control it. Rober to Kane to McDavid who shows up. Centering pass. Derek Ryan with an attempt. Hellebuck was there. And the Jets come out of it. Out of harm's way. A chance for Kupari. And what a fantastic start from Stuart Skinner. Everybody looking for the puck. It's still available. And now a whistle as the Jets had come up with it. Scheifele. Pass over Ehlers to the net. Wide as Ayafalo stops that puck, keeps it alive. Broberg with some room to move it. McLeod, one touch pass. Likely, it's Ike Ehlers who tees that one up. Excuse me, Shifley and Ehlers both out there. Kyle Connor, a pass across. Shifley looks, passes to Morrissey. Kyle Connor with a gaping open net. And it sails over top. Connor again, now off the side of the net. Kane and McLeod coming into the zone. Kane with a blistering shot there. It didn't hit the intended target. Skinner far out of his net to pull the puck to Gamble, and it's in the Oilers' net. Tie game, shorthanded marker. Nemestikov scores for the Jets. He gets aggressively and is winning this race, and Stuart Skinner sees it. He comes out and just tries to chip it over top of the stick of Ayafalo. He's got his blade down the ice. He just wants to kind of shovel this one through Ayafalo. It doesn't go. He stays with it. And he throws it out in front. It goes off in the mess. The cop bounces around, finds its way in the back of the net. You create your... To close some of it off and at least make him have to tread through sticks and bodies. And David extending his regular season point streak to 21 games. He can't corral it either. Nemesca caught to Morrissey. A pass across. A sprawling stop from Stuart Skinner. With an incredible save here. Denying Ehlers. So we'll see if maybe he does jump out there. If they can get it to overtime. There's a little more ice. Has that chance right off the faceoff. Off the faceoff. A couple of opportunities for Edmonds and Hellebuck to save. And now from center ice. It's... Sent in, Pionk has it. Last opportunity here, dying seconds. And we are headed to three on three overtime between the Oilers and the Jets. And I think you want to err on the side of caution too. It's early in the season. Try settle out there with McLeod and Ekholm. And for the Jets, it's Lowry, Ayafalo, and Morrissey. For the Jets, Shifley enters the zone, stops. Mark Shifley hands it off to Kyle Connor. Moving in a pass. And Shifley got his stick on it. Jets unable to capitalize. Ehlers moving up. He gets the puck. Ehlers crosses the line. Nikolai Ehlers cutting to the middle. Looking for some open space. Ehlers. Now he moves to the slot. The shot. It hit traffic in front. And it's Zach Hyman. He takes off with it. Ryan Nugent Hopkins moving in. Hyman a pass to Nugent Hopkins. It bounces on that. Halibut is there. He couldn't hang on to it. Here's a long range pass though. And... It's Nemesnikov who can't connect with Ehlers. Here is Kyle Connor now. Moving around with the puck up top. Kyle Connor takes a look, hands it off to Shifley. He gives it to Morrissey. Morrissey passes it right tipped home by Mark Shifley. And the Winnipeg Jets win in overtime.